A treasure hunt is underway in the Netherlands to find valuables worth millions hidden by Nazi soldiers during World War II. It's been sparked by the publication of an old map by the Dutch National Archive. It's believed the document marks the spot where German soldiers hid diamonds, rubies, gold and silver taken from a damaged bank. Our correspondent Anna Holligan says treasure hunters have descended on a small town looking for metal ammunition boxes. Well, nothing quite sparks the imagination, does it, than a real-life uh, treasure map. This is what has been released by the National Archives, and it's alleged to show the exact spot where a Nazi soldier buried loot taken during the Second World War, during the Nazi occupation of the Netherlands, four ammunition boxes apparently full of polished and uncut diamonds, gold, silver, watches and jewellery. Um, the map has just been released and treasure hunters and gold diggers from right across the Netherlands have descended on this small village. So initially the villagers, villagers were, were quite excited in, in Omen to see their, their village features. Uh, not so much now, now that uh, people have been uh, appearing armed with uh, metal detectors and spades digging up their gardens. Metal detectors are actually banned in the area as of October. Uh, so people have been uh, turned away by the council. A few fines have been issued as well, but given the potential discovery here, uh, it's unlikely to stop these uh, treasure hunters from uh, trying their luck. And uh, if they do find anything, it was actually highly unlikely because the area was scoured uh, just after the Second World War, after uh, this was initially revealed. The map has been released this week after the, uh, the time with which it could be kept uh, secret or undercover. Uh, expires at 75 years, I think it is. So uh, it's free and available for anyone to, to go and have a search, although the council is urging people to stay away. Anna Holligan there. Do get in touch with me.